There are so many myths about the Council of Nicaea that fundamentalists, atheists, and Muslims like this guy put out, but none of them know the actual history. The Council didn't even discuss the biblical canon, and no early sources mention that. They were brought together mainly to deal with the Arian heresy, discuss the date of Easter, the role of church law, and other administrative issues. There's no evidence Constantine added any paganism into Christianity, nor was he involved in the formation of the canon. As Bart Ehrman says, The historical reality is that the Emperor Constantine had nothing to do with the formation of the canon of scripture. Again, the main issue for the council was the Arian heresy, which wanted to turn Jesus into a created being. This would have actually been more in line with paganism, since most of the deities of the pagan world were created. But of the over 200 bishops that attended, all but a handful voted against Arius, and confirmed that Jesus and the Father were of the same substance. The claim there was massive disagreement among the attendees is also a myth. So the council did not discuss the canon, nor was paganism added to Christianity. This is just pseudo-historical garbage.